Oh, I'm stewing a little bit because, oh. uh, so yesterday we called each other's spouse in secret and asked the question, which one of this person's habits in the bedroom bothers you the most? And really gave them no direction, tried to leave it a little open-ended yeah. to, you know, just let them take it as, interpret it the way they will. So I was not in the studio when Jesse posed this question to my boyfriend and, um, we're trying to do this match game style, so I'm going to try and guess what his answer was to the question. What do I think he said? Which I, I, I can't <sighs> wait to hear your guess. I, I, that was one of the things I was so nervous about because I didn't want to divulge something that, you know, you, you, try, to, you try to diffuse the situation in a sense because you don't want that, you know, the, what, you know, the worst case scenario answer to come out. You'd rather, you know, if you, if you deliver it, well, okay, you kind of kind of soften the blow mm -hmm. but then again if, if he gives you a different answer gives me a different answer then you just evolved something that <laughs> undoubtedly i'm going to use against you right the competitive side of me wants to get the answer right right okay uh so i'm kind of willing to put something out there but then at the same time you have brought up a great point which is well i might divulge something about myself that i don't want to yeah but he didn't even go there you know what i mean like yeah i might give away really something telling <laughs> um, I, I kind of am going to err on the side. After stewing it over for a day, because there was one answer I was really, really nervous about. I was thinking for sure he was going to go in this direction. And now today I'm kind of feeling like, okay. It's not going to go there. I don't think it's going to go there. I, I have a couple of ideas, but I'm going to go with... So I have really bad circulation sometimes, and okay. I think it's a women a woman thing because sure. I don't know if it, like Jeannie gets this way, but like my hands are cold all the time, like really? freezing cold, and I don't know why that is. But <laughs> so like he hates this because like a lot of times we'll get into bed and you'll and I'll like I'll, I know my hands are cold. And I'll go and, like, grab him on his, like, love handles or yeah. something, you know, like, wherever it's going to make a, ah, one of those reactions. She totally does the same thing, and it drives me bananas. And he's, he hates it because he's like, yeah. God, get it. your hands are freezing. Right. And I'm like, I know. That's why I want them on warm. your warm body <laughs> yes. because it'll warm my hands up. It's got to be a woman thing then, I guess. <laughs> it does because she does the same thing. She so, does. I'm going cold hands. All right. Well, <laughs> survey says we'll play the phone call. Oh, it's riveting. <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> and here we go. This is Brent. What's up, Brent? It's Jesse. How are you doing, Jesse? Good, man. How are you doing? I'm good. Just trying to, to do things around the house while Lucy's at work. Nice. Well, that's good. You're a good man. I'm trying. She was talking about that, how, uh, yeah, you, uh, you're pretty much keeping everything afloat over there. I don't know if that's true. Wish she'd come home occasionally, though, because I don't have a card this week. So that's, <laughs> that's, that's right. She did say that. I totally forgot about that. Well, so we're uh, we're gonna ask. I'm gonna ask you, and then she's not in the studio right now, uh, and then she's gonna call my wife. But I want to know your your candid uh, answer. What habit in the bedroom bothers you the most about your uh, lovely significant other? She's kind of a prude. <laughs> Yeah, she kind of is. I mean, she's cool. I'm not going to, you know, I don't want to say I'm not satisfied, Jesse. Sure. Because believe me, I am. But, <laughs> no, I mean, she's just, I, and, and this is nothing against her. I hope she doesn't feel bad about this, but she's, she's just not very adventurous. Sure. You, you know, she, she, uh, oh, she I think she grew up in a conservative household. And, and that still crosses over. She's a good person. I don't know. You know, you'll, you'll learn that about Lucy. But she's funny. She's a little bit, uh, she's out there. But she, she overall, she's one of those people you go, eh, that's a straight up good person. Yep, and, yep. And so maybe she doesn't want to get freaky in the sack, whatever, that's how things are. <laughs> well, she was saying that, you know, her. she feels like her sex drive has gone down a little bit as she's uh, gotten a little bit older. Oh, I don't think so. Really? I think she, she's still pretty randy, if you ask me. Yeah, but just just maybe not as adventuresome as you'd like her to be at times? Yeah, I mean, you know, butt stuff, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> I love it, dude. I love it. I can't wait. Wow. I'm, I'm glad that was the question you asked because that was that was pretty simple. Yeah, you. It almost was like you were just looking for that outlet. You were looking to, to let somebody else know <laughs> that, right? I, I was sitting here thinking when you when you, uh, she said you were going to call. I knew I figured you guys were doing that bit, and I thought I was like, "Gosh, what's he going to ask me? I hope I have a good answer. I don't want to be lame." Right. That, right. That's perfect. Thanks, Jesse. You got it, brother. Have a good one. You too. Oh man. <laughs> You know what? I can't even be mad about it because he's right. Yeah. I am kind of a prude in the bedroom. I am. I just There's nothing wrong with that. 
<sighs> I don't know. I'm really shy. I mean, and I guess that's I, that's really putting myself out there. I didn't know he was going to say that. That's funny. Um, and actually, that goes in line with the other answer that I was going to say that was really telling, which I'll tell you off sure. the air because I don't want to <laughs> say it on the air. <laughs> Oh, so, you know what? If I would have gone with that other one, I would have probably qualified as, like, actually getting it right. Really? So we both struck out. Yeah, and you know what's funny <laughs> is we, it both related to sex, really. Yeah. Or Apparently in some cases, lack thereof. We're not satisfying our, no. our significant others. Maybe, maybe we have to swap. Hey, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. And if you want to check out more of The Loon Morning Show, go to 1037theloon.com.